Hey guys, my name is Brian, social media coordinator here at Moonshine. Hey, my name is Jennifer, a social media manager here at Moonshine. And today we're playing Underrated, Overrated. Time travel. I'm gonna say overrated. I'm gonna say overrated. I feel like every time someone tries to do time travel, they always end up messing it up. Too many, too many people have tried and gotten it wrong. So we should just leave it alone at this point. Too many we should leave have it. Tried. We should just leave it alone. And I've got. <laughs> <laughs> Like, let's leave that. I agree. I think it's overrated because, yeah, people don't do it right. Or if they time travel, they go and do something stupid. They don't exactly. utilize their time correctly. Exactly. Or they yeah, get upset yeah. when, like, things are not the same when they come back to the original exactly. era, whatever era or time that they're in. Exactly. You can't get mad when you're the one who did it. <laughs> <laughs> overrated. Overrated. Definitely overrated. Beach volleyball. Ooh. Overrated. <laughs> if I'm going to play volleyball, give me a court. <laughs> Beach volleyball, it's like there's just sand everywhere. If you dive, you literally get sand every, like literally just the sand. Honestly, the sand is the worst part. And that's why I don't like beach volleyball. Wow. But I do like the concept of, you know, oh, let's all go to the beach. Like in my head, but when I get there and I'm like, ooh. The actual execution is not the same. Exactly. I have to totally disagree. I think it's underrated. Okay. I th- <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. No, I think it's underrated. I think it's so fun. Like, you ever see those movies where they throw the ball really high and they're like, bam! Yeah. Or it's like a team and you're like on the beach and they're like, Well, that's boom, what I'm saying. Like, the, the idea, like the, then... fan- like the movie fantasy of like a Baywatch, like slow motion hitting a ball in the air. That's great. Yeah. But when you get there and you're actually there and it's like, ew, like wet sand. Some kid like over there, like <laughs> like he's crying, crying, puking. In it's the not corner. the it's not what you imagine it to be, you know. Cryptocurrency. Ooh, overrated. I agree, overrated. Definitely overrated. I never got the appeal of cryptocurrency. I never got into it. Still don't really fully understand what it is. Did you invest in not Doggo Coin? Dogecoin. Dogecoin. <laughs> Dogecoin. Dogecoin. <laughs> no, I never got into Dogecoin. I never got into Bitcoin. I I hardly know how to use real money. So I'm mm-hmm. like, if you're going to do anything, invest in stocks. Yeah, that's the safe thing to do. Not that we're... Stonks. <laughs> <laughs> not that we're investors and can actually give you like advice. Yeah, not that we're, we're like just... Wolf on Wall Street. <laughs> no, Wolf on Wall Street. <laughs> <laughs> Bankers. But... Haunted houses. Haunted houses, I think, are so totally underrated. I have only. No, I've never been to one. I've never been to one before. What? You've never been to a haunted house? I haven't. I didn't grow up celebrating Halloween. It's like a new concept to me, but I'd like to go. I love to be scared. I want you to come out with a chainsaw, a bat. Huge scissors, like (laughs) (laughs) huge scissors. What? (laughs) Something scary. I would say underrated as well. I like a good haunted house. They were kind of like just those ones at like the county fair. Clearly, it's like you know Johnny down the street with like a mask on. But like it's still like I'm like with a mask from Walmart. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) With like some splatter to catch up on. Yeah. Board games. Ooh, underrated. I think underrated. If you get the right one. Yes. Monopoly, overrated. you can you can take leave it. Monopoly alone by itself, overrated. Overrated. But like board games in general, underrated. underrated. Yes. Are you a Scrabble fan? No. Wow. No. Why? I'm not big on spelling. <laughs> you can cut there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, breakfast burritos. Underrated. I would agree. You got your eggs. You got a meat, a protein. Maybe some people throw in a hash brown, a little jalapeno. Mm-hmm. For you're set to go in the morning. You're not gonna be hungry till lunchtime. Definitely underrated. For sure. Escape rooms. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like waiting for you to say it before I say I'm mine. I'm gonna say so totally overrated. Okay. <laughs> The first time I did an escape room, I was I was highly disappointed because people were like hyping it up, like, "Oh, escape rooms! You work with your your friends and family to get out of this. It builds mm-hmm. team bonding." The whole time, I was just annoyed. We were trying to work together. No one was really listening to each other, though. It felt like the juice was not worth the squeeze because once mm. we figure this out, what do we win? Quality they, time. They, quality time and satisfaction. That's what I don't think so. I see. I'm saying underrated for this because. I've done a few escape rooms. The people you're going there with are going there just because they want to have fun and they're not in it to win it, then it's going to be annoying. But if you get a group of people who their goal is to make the escape room happen, then it's fun because I've actually conquered an escape room. A conquer. And I can tell you the satisfaction that you get when you walk out of that door, key in hand, and you get to take your picture on that wall. Key in the picture? The picture on the wall being like, I escaped, holding the sign. Like, That's your prize though? Like you feel like it's worth it? Yeah. It is. 
That I have that. That's that's forever. That's for life. Okay. Definitely underrated. Impromptu road trips. For me, I like to plan things out. No, I get that. So un- overrated. For I'm yeah, I'm gonna say overrated because the idea of being like, yeah, let's just like you know on the yeah. in the moment like let's go somewhere sounds so much fun, but then the actual doing it I feel like would be a hot mess. You know the saying that's like if you don't plan, how, how's it go? If you don't plan to fail. If you don't <laughs> wait, <laughs> I know you. I know what saying you you're talking about. If you don't plan to fail, you fail. If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. Let's say that again. If you plan to fail, yeah. <laughs> Let's just. <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like it's not fun buying the snacks, planning out the route, going to whatever destination you're going to. You've never been there. Have Where you Googled it? When yeah. You get there. You What's know. the crime rate? Like, <laughs> you figure that Am out. Am I coming back from the trip? From the trip? Exactly. Yeah, I yeah. think it's overrated. Karaoke. Karaoke, she's sneaky. I used to think she was overrated. But then I actually went to karaoke and it completely changed my life. So underrated for sure. Okay. You're in a room with your friends. You've got drinks. You've got food. you got the lights, the strobe lights. You can change the colors of them. You just It's such a vibe. Underrated for sure. Very glad we're on the same page here because I'm in full agreement with you on this one because I... Similar to you, I went to karaoke for the first time maybe two years ago. And ever since then, I've been all about karaoke. Oh, wow. So much fun. Definitely underrated. Definitely underrated for sure. What do you guys think? Were some of these overrated or underrated? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And we'll see you next time. Bye.